safe to say that no one had ever seen anything like it. Uh, I've, I've been in the bowling business for about 45 years, and that's about as ridiculous as I've seen. Some people took pictures with their cell phones. Uh, it's amazing. This is the first time I've ever seen something like this. I've seen a lot of strange things, but uh, this is the first. Others actually videotaped the event. We're going to show everybody <laughs> in our league on Monday night. We're going to show everybody because they're not going to believe it. <laughs> you got to see it to believe it. And it seemed like everyone had an opinion about it. I think it's asinine. Crazy. So who or what is it that could possibly inspire such a wide range of opinions and emotions? It's this guy right here, James Cripps, as most folks call him, the backwards bowler. I think the obvious question is, how did you start bowling backwards? Honestly, I did it on a bet. Uh, just as a joke, because I'm horrible forward, I just pushed one down the lane backward, and uh, it struck. That's where it started. It started and just can't stop. Believe it or not, he was almost forced to stop. It seems that bowling lane operators weren't exactly thrilled with his unorthodox style. No backward bowling allowed. They considered it horseplay. The, the first time, I actually had a 90 in the fifth frame, and they kicked me out. And I looked at the two lanes beside me. I said, nobody else has a score higher than me. But yet I'm horse playing. We don't allow it. Get out. So I got out. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Thankfully, he didn't stay out. Tennessee native has been bowling backwards for nearly four years now. He carries an average of 184. His high score is 279. And he once threw 11 straight strikes. As for what his future holds... Wouldn't mind doing a beer commercial. I think it'd be a good idea. Regardless of whether or not the beer companies come calling, Cripps plans on going forward or, uh, you know, in this case, backwards with his bowling. You know, people get a kick out of it, and uh, as long as people like it, and I'm not offending the majority, I'll keep doing it.